Um, I suppose the way guys like Mitchell Clayton and Matt Coles closed up the last two hours was obviously exceptional. And, um, we knew we were, we were sort of behind the eight ball for most of the second innings, but we knew that a couple of good overs and we were right back in it. And obviously the way those guys delivered at the death obviously did the job for us. You were out there batting for a while at the halfway stage, 159, did that seem under par? Uh, no, I actually said in the shed before we came out, I thought it was about on par. I think the way, look at the spinners, Liam Dawson, Shahid Freddie bowled. It was really tough to get the ball away when they put them in the right areas. And, it did start to skid on a touch under lights and made it a little bit easier to bat, but still the pitch underlying still wasn't an absolute belter. We knew that if we got a couple of wickets, it'd be hard to get going. Yeah, I was doing your game against Glamorgan at the weekend, and then it looked kind of tough chasing, and there were a lot of people in the shed not used, and, and Hampshire had the same thing today. The likes of Afridi sitting there with his pads on, one of the biggest hitters in world cricket, and he didn't get out to the middle. Is that all part of the master plan? Uh, yeah, not particularly. <laughs> I, I must say, I, I was pretty happy to see him up there with the, with the pads on up in the sheds rather than out there in the middle, but. That's one of the things. One of those things. If uh, Blakey had taken that catch in the last over, he might have been coming out to face the last five balls. So you can't, I suppose, get hung up on little things like that. But we're just pretty happy to, to take the two points and move on to next week. Yeah, and it, uh, having lost on Sunday, good to good to win this one. Full house, I think, at, at Canterbury on on Friday. So there are lots to play for in this in this competition. Are very tight. Absolutely. I think you look at our group. I mean, we're, we're one point two, one win off second, and probably two losses off last. So I think everyone in the group is still in it for the for the quarterfinals. And, we just know that we've got to go out, um, go to training again tomorrow, do the same things we've done this week, and hopefully the result falls our way again. Well done tonight.